I'ma make a purse out of you. Which side do you want the zipper on? smaller than this. Why am I wearing enough clothes for a 400-pound clown? You're styling! Remember, you have to blend in here. I'm not supposed to be blending in here. I'm supposed to be battling Phobos and Meridian. And finding the rightful heir to the throne, who is somewhere in your ridiculously dressed world. Ooh, Caleb, you are one major chunk. Um, it's hunk, Grandma. But wait till you see him in his golf outfit! Can't command a rebellion dressed like a parachute? Ow! Oh, sorry. Was that your knee? <gasps> you guys have got to come in and see Caleb's new outfit. I made this really cute retro aviator 50s thing, and I think if you four hold him down, then... I can't believe you're wearing those clothes. Blunk got it going on. Oh, no. Blunk got it coming off. I made those for Caleb. If I find him, he's going to wish Phobos found him first. <laughs> Doing here? Never mind that. Why aren't you wearing these clothes? At first, I wasn't sure how it would look with your skin tone, but I was right. You're much more of a spring than an autumn. <laughs> he looks like an overgrown raisin. Ah, Caleb jealous. Blank the bomb. <laughs> Shall we get down, devil boy? I thought all Earthlings were strange, but I'm beginning to think it's just the females. Caleb, you're a guest in this dimension. You can't go all rebel leader on us. Promise me. Oh, he's so cute when he sulks. <laughs> We should follow him! Girls, please, let me suggest another plan. What did he buy? Glue. Glue for what? Glue to stick on his realistic rubber human face! Uh, Definitely. Why am I even here? We've got to go to Will's house right now. Oh, look! He's dreaming he's swimming. Gee, now he's wet. Maybe his glued-on face will come off easier. Tonight, Caleb. Hey, what are friends for? I am getting paid, right? Uh, I don't think that order was to go. I'll have the chicken! I'm pretty sure we're all out of chicken. Uh, ka oh, what is that smell? It smells like something died! No, it smells like something died, came back to life, fell in a vat of old cheese, and then died again. <laughs> Hi. Know that smell? It's dirty, it's vile. It's blunk. Blunk new pad, groovy, huh? I think you mean gravy. You smell disgusting. Thank you. Blunk tries. Yeah. Flip top tongue scraper. Blunk, ugh, you're driving customers away. You need a bath. Bath bath. <laughs> no, soapy water bath. Good. Stinky stink. 
bad. Oh, come on, Stinkmeister. Uh, this won't hurt a bit. Ah, let Blanc go. Give Caleb treasure. <laughs> Meet Necklace. <laughs> guys, guys, guess what? Wow, what happened to you? Standard hero injuries. Yeah. Huh. Anyway, Alex. So, what did you hear about Brian? I didn't listen. You didn't listen? It's bad enough I've got to hang a towel from my pants and ask people if they want extra apricot sauce. I'm not going to go further demean myself by jotting down the ramblings of a love-struck girl. If you hide behind the mandarin tree and take notes, I'll do your next shift. Interesting. <gasps> but, but they haven't seen my volcano! Grandma said you were at the dump, but why? I was looking for the horn of Hypnos, but it wasn't there. I know how to break the trance. Uh... Horn, is it about this big and kind of goldy shiny like? Yes, where is it? Uh, from the trash to the restaurant to. Oh no, the school band! Hey, walkie talkies! I love these things! Yeah, they'll be a huge help during the major assault on the castle. I got eight pairs. Go get them! Nice hat, by the way. <sighs> well, this is it. The final battle for Meridian has begun. You should go on ahead. I'll be in the other world if you need me. 